Welcome back everybody to some more Fighter Z. Last we left off, there was a lot of shit that happened. Yeah, we got Vegeta. And now I forgot what we're doing. Oh, that's right, Frieza. I think that's right, we uh, we fought the Ginyu Force. And Frieza was like, alright, well, uh, they, uh, that was fun, bye. So yeah, now we are going to... Hmm, how am I going to do this? This looks like just a regular fight, so... Oh, this actually looks like I'm fighting Cell. Okay. So maybe we'll go down this way. And then we'll fight with the Saiyans. Let's see how the Saiyans do. I've actually been playing quite a bit of the multiplayer. I've been getting into ranked matches and just doing some of the, um, the party the party match lobbies. The party matches are actually really fun. I'm having a lot of fun with the uh, shuffle party match where you basically go in you can go in with six players total. So it's you and five other people. I'll, I'll wait till the cutscene. I don't care much for that woman though. I suppose I should offer my thanks. After all she has given me the perfect opportunity to dispose of the two of you rejects. <laughs> dispose of us? I was thinking the same thing about you. I can finally crush you with my two bare hands! Very well then, if you wish to die that badly. Wait a sec! What do you want? Kakarot, stay out of this! Who says you get to fight first, Vegeta? It's not fair! Nobody cares! Quit bothering me! You got in my way the last time we fought Frieza in case you don't remember! Yeah, well, sorry about that, but if you'll remember, I didn't have much of a choice. Whatever, just stay out of my way! And we'll call it even. Well, technically I saved you earlier, so aren't we already even? When you were knocked out and Frieza tried to attack you, I blocked the attack and saved you. Shut up! Why do you always bring that up? Now if you're done trying to steal my moment of glory, I have a fight to get to. Jeez, no need to be so moody, Vegeta. Just let me fight Frieza for a little bit, okay? Cool? A bit? Do I look stupid? Just let me fight! That is enough! You have some nerve making me listen to this juvenile squabbling! That's something I seriously cannot stand about the two of you mindless monkeys! If you two want to fight me so badly, then I'll just destroy you both at the same time! I'll crush the two of you with my bare hands! Uh, I think that you already used that line. So yeah, anyway, party shuffle. Basically, it's you and five other people. They can add, like, two for spectators, I think. But, um, basically, you choose one character that you want to play as, and then you go into, basically, a giant fighting arena screen. And what the game does is it'll mix and match you between two different teams, and after it's got three people on each team, it sends you into the fight. And what you're going to be doing is you're going to be... You only can control your one character. So whoever's fighting has the option to either tag you out and then you start playing or they can use you as an assist. So basically every character is in charge of fighting as their own character. So I'll see a lot of people that are like using their characters really well and just using assists or I'll see the people that are just really bad and they'll just go straight for like the uh, tag out immediately. I fought some pretty good people on there. I've seen a lot of Gohans. I was, I think I was usually playing Android 18. I know her assist isn't as good for co-op play, but um, that was what I was doing. I've also been playing a lot in terms of uh, trying to find new characters that I like to play as. Is that it? Okay. Because since the new DLC came out, Bardock and Broly both came out. And for those of you who don't know, Bardock is my fucking top tier, absolute favorite character. Second only, like, is Trunks. Uh-oh. Hey, look, Boo's back, I guess. Guess I'll go through there. But, yeah. He came out, and I added him to my team, and I love him. His attacks are so great. His supers can... They're both in the air and on the ground, so he's so versatile with what he can do. Um, I love that they included his Super Saiyan from the uh, from the first I Super Saiyan special like movie. This, this is awesome! 
Wow. I thought we saw the last of him after I used the spirit bomb to defeat him. Oh well, guess I'll just have to beat him with my own power this time. Kakarot, don't be naive. This one's different from the other clones. Oh yeah? He doesn't seem all that different to me. Then look at that. <laughs> what? He, he's asleep? Falling asleep before a fight. I guess he really is different from the other clones. I think he's just messing with us. That's his first mistake. I say we wake him up. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like he's awake now. Come to think of it, I wonder if he can't fight unless he does that. How the hell should I know? <laughs> this time, I'll be the one who finally puts an end to him. Hey, I'm not gonna let you hog all the fun. So back to what I was saying, <laughs> I know I'm trying to like have an actual conversation while I'm playing, but um, all of his moves are like super fun to do just in midair or um, in the on the ground, and like a, the the his ultimate his level three is basically from that one movie that he was in where he went back in time from Frieza's blast. He didn't just die, and. Um, at the end of the movie, I'm not gonna, actually I'm not gonna spoil anything. But at the end of the movie, he powers up really fast and really hard. <laughs> and basically, they added his final attack from the from the um, from the movie as his level three. All, all right, Vegeta, let's get you out here. Him in the face. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> He's out. Nice. So now on my team, I have as my point, I usually have Android 18. I know she got nerfed from the beta because she doesn't do nearly as much damage with any of her attacks. Her attacks are all very combo based now, so. I've had to learn how to implement 17 into all of her attacks. But, uh, ooh, do I want to fight Frieza? This one's an actual fight, too. I kind of want to fight that. Sorry, Trunks, we'll get to you. And, um, my middle is Hit. I have Hit because he is one of the few characters that I found that has a counter. I don't think any of the other ones do, honestly. Like, he doesn't have a key attack that he shoots out for his A. His, um... His key attack is literally just a counter, and for those of you who don't know, I love counter characters in fighting games because they're so fun to do, just turning your opponent's attacks on them. So, it's always fun to for the opponent to shoot off like a key blast, something like at the beginning of the fight, and you counter it and hit. When he counters it, he immediately goes goes like right next to them and hits them. So it's it's always a good opener where they're like, oh shit, he's already attacking me and I couldn't block, and then you just pull off a nice combo for that. Oh, fuck. I'm still trying to figure out how to do the uh the down bit. Like I'm not I'm still not the super awesome pro player at this game. So so I make do with what I can, but... Oh. I'm still getting better. Sorry if I don't talk when I'm doing certain combos, it's because I'm sitting there trying to think about it. Alright, fuck it. Oh, that's the one move I don't think I've ever really figured out how to do properly. Just 
<laughs> just fucking kick him in the dick. Fuck you, Nappa. What was that face Nap was making? I don't know if anybody saw that, but when he hit the ground, he was still like open mouth, just like ah. If I remember to, I'll try and cut that into the video. But that was weird looking. All right, I guess it's time to actually fight Trunks. He's been waiting like a good boy. He's level fourteen. Should be fun. This should be a great fight. Let's do this. Saiyans versus this fucking weird ass team matchup. Trunks, Nappa, and Cell. I always love seeing Nappa put on teams because it's like, what? Why? Why why are why are they together? Nappa is actually fucking a tank in multiplayer from what I've seen. I've seen like one good guy with him and when you know what you're doing with Nappa, oh boy, oof, that thing hurts. You're not getting away. You're not getting away. Oh, they're attacking back. Fuck you, Trunks. A whole bitch. Bitch. Oh fuck, I'm trying to figure out how to consistently do the uh, knock-up combo without using a dash, because that's actually pretty essential for getting a decent amount of attacks in. So excuse me if I use the story mode to do a bit more extra practicing. Alright, you know what, fuck it. I'm not going to waste time doing it, so... There we go. If I can't do it in the first couple of uh, tries, I'll I'll finish up the match. I don't want people sitting there waiting, watching me flail around like a dumbass. Sad nobody had any interactions with Trunks. Figured maybe Vegeta would have one, but I guess not. Oh well. Let's keep going. Oh, I've waited for this day to come ever since I lost to you. Now finally, I have the chance to right that wrong. Cell. No matter how many times you find a way to come back, I'll always defeat you. But is that really you, Gohan? There is something different about you. I can't quite put my finger on it yet. What do you mean, different? Oh, that's right! You were a lot smaller when you beat him, so he didn't recognize you now that you're big! Oh my god, Goku. You know that's not what I meant. Clearly, your energy is diminished. I sense a lack of the same overwhelming power. You're definitely weaker. When I look at your face, I perceive a hint of the Gohan I fought before. But you're hardly the same person. There's no doubt about that. W well ah! <laughs> You figured it out, huh? God damn it, Goku. So focused on his studies that he skimped out on his training. Oops. And there we have it. Your strength just isn't what it used to be, Gohan. Well, I've been training again recently, so I'm not as weak as you think. Enough with the excuses. I don't want any more disappointments. I was hoping for the chance to have a little fun before ending your life. You know, like broken bones and some bleeding. 
However, at this rate, it appears I won't be able to enjoy any of that at all. At least try to muster up some kind of strength, you worthless little runt. Am I going to have to do what I did back then and take advantage of that little temper of yours? Man, I love so. He's so sadistically funny. All right, let's do this. Level 17 cell versus us. Not really that close. About three levels lower from our maximums. But uh, I think Goku can take it. Let's throw Goku in and see how he does the entire fight. Just all Goku. Like it was meant to be. I'll try to keep forgetting I can angle that. I'm gonna cut her Goku's moves. I haven't used him ever. Oh, jeez. Hey! Aha! There we go. <laughs> Boom! Fuck you, Cell. Goku for the win. Never thought I'd actually say that seriously. Alrighty, let's fight Nappa. Oh boy. See what Napster's up to. Napa and Ginyu. Those are two people I thought would always make a actual, like, semi-decent kind of team. If Napa was a little stronger. I know Napa was pretty weak comparative once they got to the Ginyu saga, but um Yeah, it would have been cool to see them interact more. Cause apart from Vegeta and I guess Raditz, we don't really get to see them interact with the rest of Frieza's empire. So it'd be pretty cool to see a bit more of that life of the Empire. Oh, not even a cutscene. I figured there'd be at least something. Fuck you, fuck you. Off. Nappa. And I'm pretty sure there's no way to do his, like, level 3. Yeah. I don't think there's any way to do it. Yeah, there's no way to do it. Okay. Whatever. Hey, remember me? You tried to steal my body. You could have been, like, epic. Oh, you really don't like Vegeta. Nice. I got fucked. Super Warrior Arc Chapter Eight Bon Appetit Android Twenty One's Endless Hunger. Oh, hey, we're on the Kai planet. Elder Kai, what do you think? Hmm, I'm sensing something bad. Something terribly evil. 
Hermosphere's like someone took all the warriors on Earth and rolled them into one. All the warriors? And that's not all. Frieza. And that android cell. Even Boo. The terrifying villains our friends defeated seem to have returned. Boo too? Things could go completely out of control if something's not done. This is terrible. Unfortunately, we don't have a horse in this here race. The gods keep watch, plain and simple. We'll just have to believe our friends can pull through. Come on, Goku. You can do it. Yeah. Beat the shit out of that pink girl. I thought it was nice that they ended up um, splitting up Kabito and Supreme Kai again. So it's not Kabito Kai anymore. Gohan Link event. Gohan Super Saiyan's Link event. Uh, cool. Let's do their Link events then. Sure. How do I do that? Oh. Cool. Let's do it. Dating Sim. I gotta admit, it's an odd feeling sharing bodies with someone else. Wait a sec. Are we actually having this conversation inside my head? You can hear my thoughts? Then that means you know what I'm thinking without me saying it? Jeez. Contrary to popular belief, I'm not thinking about Fidel and Pan 24-7. Okay? I didn't Don't bring that up. Wrong. I'm super happy with my family. Heck, I think about them pretty much all the time. Wait, uh, crap, just contradicted myself. Can we keep this our little secret? Nope. Tone Vegeta. But it is nice that he is a good person, I guess. Alright, let's see what Goku's up to.